Hey guys, it's Alex Osh1234 here, and this video will show you how to get tethering on your iPhone, iPhone 3G, or iPhone 3GS, which comes out tomorrow. Now this is an awesome hack, but I say hack, but it kind of is, kind of isn't. You're going to be downloading a mobile configuration file from this website. I'm going to take you through it and all the steps. And this will allow your phone to, to be tethered to your computer. And what tethering is, is you're using your iPhone or iPhone 3G, whatever iPhone you have, as a modem for your computer. Meaning that you can use the internet, maybe the 3G connection from your iPhone and uh, use the internet on your computer. So you're taking the connection from your iPhone and using it on your computer. It's an awesome thing to do. When I was had a jailbroken iPhone 3G, I was using PDA Net, which worked great, and now we can just do it without jailbreaking. But I still like jailbreaking for all the mods and everything, but still. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to this website right here. It's gonna be in the description, but you have to go on it on your iPhone. So go in Safari and type this in, help.benm dot at slash help dot php now that's going to take you to this mobile website that the developer of the site made up and he did an awesome job so it gives you a description of what you can do and uh, it tells some updates he's going to be making adding more configuration files for uh, other nations other state well, not states but other wireless providers and then you can scroll down it tells you about it what you're going to do you're going to go to right here tethering and internet settings you're gonna click download oops just getting used to this 3.0 firmware I got it last night so <laughs> but overall right now it's pretty sweet it's a lot faster than I expected okay so you're gonna scroll down now we have all these countries and I live in the US but you can go to your country say you live in India Ireland Israel wherever you live but I'm sure a lot of you live in the United States and UK so you're going to click US, USA. Now, it brings up two providers, AT&T and T-Mobile. I have AT&T. I'm sure most of you do, too. So you click on AT&T. Now, it's going to load it up. And what it's going to do is it takes you into your phone, and it's going to bring up this install profile thing. Now, this is the mobile configuration file. I already have it installed, but you're going to click install right here click install and it's just going to show up like this so click install and then it's going to say done at the top right here click done when it's all done then you can it's already installed so you can click the home button now what we do is we can go into settings and now we can go to general and let me just show you a couple things network you can scroll down and you can see internet tethering is right there and I'm going to show you where we download that mobile configuration file to and I'm going to show you how to set up internet tethering on your iPhone 3G, iPhone or iPhone 3GS so we have it right here I can turn it on and to say that I'll say turn on Bluetooth I already have set it up I think it will go on I'm not a hundred percent sure I'm getting used to the whole internet tethering um, I might have to pair it again but I'll just turn it off for now but also we installed that mobile configuration file and you can see it's right there on your main general settings scroll down and you can see profile and you can see that's the mobile configuration file and this is an awesome hack so right now you have internet tethering on your iPhone iPhone 3G iPhone 3GS this is awesome because AT&T they were gonna make us pay extraordinary amounts of money uh, to get this but now we can we don't have to wait we can have it right now when we get our iPhone 3GS or I have our iPhone 3G and it has to be on the 3.0 firmware so that's all you gotta do and you can click for more details and it gives you some advanced settings I'm not really sure how this 100% works I mean this is awesome but I'm just gonna show you how to do it okay so we're gonna go to how to do tethering on your iPhone 3G or iPhone 3GS or iPhone Okay, so I'm going to show you how to set up tethering on your iPhone. So go to general, and you can either have Bluetooth on or off, depending on what you want to use, Bluetooth or USB. Right now I'm using a USB, and you can see that 
I'm using internet tethering now. So you can click network, internet tethering's on, and I'm using USB right now, I have it plugged in. But you can either use Bluetooth too. And to set this up, I'm using my MacBook, MacBook here, but you can just click system prefs, and you wanna go to click on network right here. And you can see this is what it's connected on. And you can see all my information, but I'll cover this up. <laughs> Okay, and it has all this information here, but you want to click on add right here, and then you want to click on open. You want to click on Ethernet adapter. Any one of these should work. If there's an EN5 one, click on that, click create, and then you want to click apply. And I think it won't find it because I'm already connected. Let me see. I'll take it off. If I put it back on, click apply. And you can see it connected because I deleted it and I added a new one and it connected. You can see that it's on and it's using the internet tethering right there. And this, you can kind of just fiddle around with this. It's not very hard. You want to click apply at the bottom here. If it's not finding it, it'll apply the information and make sure it's connected right here. <laughs> okay, so you also, to use Bluetooth, you just want to click on system preferences again. You can do this on a PC, depending on where you do this stuff. It would be in a control panel, pretty sure. And you can click on Bluetooth. And you want to pair it up. You can click on the add button again, and it will. And you, you want to click on mobile phone. Continue, and it will search for my. Oh, actually, it won't find it because you have to be on Bluetooth for this to work. Obviously, for the Bluetooth to work. So I just turn Bluetooth on. It's going to turn on, and hopefully, it'll find it. Let me go back and restart it. Sometimes that will easily find it. And you can see it found it very quickly. Click continue, and let's see what's going to happen. It's just very simple. You got to pair it up, and it'll work. So it says it's gathering the additional information. Click continue. Click continue. And right now, let me see. I'm using the internet tethering. And sometimes a passcode came, will come up that you need to confirm. I think I already did that before. That's why I'm a little confused uh, trying to tell you guys because I've already done a lot of the steps. But overall, it's kind of just uh, fiddling around with it. And uh, I, that's what I did. I easily got it working. You can also look up some tutorials online. I'm sure some tutorials on Google are already set up for this because people have had it a while with all the devs getting the beta firmwares. So just check that out. I, I actually looked at one of the tutorials. Um, and it's very simple. And you can just try it out. And I really appreciate it. I hope this video uh, helps you out. Let me just confirm that I'm using the internet tethering. You can see that I'm not on a wireless network. That's why this is not filled up with the three bars. Now, we can go on. It's going to load up CNN.com, my homepage. Okay, one sec. And there you go, guys. It loaded up CNN rather quickly. And I don't even have a good connection in my room. Uh, in my room right now. It's all blurry, sorry. Maybe I should put it on HD settings. It's only on standard, but it comes out in HD on YouTube. So, I hope you enjoy this video. Sorry it was a little all over the place because there's a lot of different things you can do. And I'm just this is my first day with internet tethering. Uh, I might come out with a more detailed, well not detailed, but more clear explanation of how to set it up on your computer. But overall, it's pretty simple. Make sure you just follow the steps. Uh, mess around with it a little. If you don't get it working, click apply on the... Uh, on the USB and uh, pair it up. A passcode will come for Bluetooth. You just pair it up and uh, you click internet tethering and in general network oh, and make sure you have Bluetooth on also. And uh, oops, sorry, it's blurry. It's like trying to focus. It's because I have two bright lights at once. There we go. And uh, internet tethering is on tethering is on. Sorry this is a quite a long video but I hope this helps you out. Make sure to follow that first step with installing that mobile configuration file. I hope this video helps and uh, shows you an awesome hack. And this is not jailbreaking. Jailbreaking is coming out very soon, maybe tomorrow.
for the uh, iPhone. I'll have a tutorial out on that. Make sure you subscribe, rate the video five stars, and favorite if you want, just so you can show it to your friends and all that. Just show them that you have tethering and they don't. Maybe show it to them also. So I, ho I hope you like this video. Peace out, guys. And uh, you can put on the comments if you have any questions. I'll try to answer those. Sorry if I get a ton. I mean, just search around a bit. That's the main way I figure out some things if I have problems. I hope you like this. Peace out.